I am Anil Kumar sharing with you another excellent question based on annuities. In these questions, we need to figure out whether we are working on present value or future value. The question here is, how much must I deposit in my account that earns 6% interest compounded monthly so that monthly loan payment of $200 can be withdrawn for one year? So clearly it says how much must I deposit in my account so you're depositing now right that earns this much of interest so from the question if you read carefully you know what you're trying to find how much must I deposit in my account right so it means present value so we need to find the present value correct so let's write on the formula and what all is given to you so the present value formula is the monthly payments which you want to make right and it is 1 minus the interest 1 plus rate of interest to the power of minus I should write I actually interest rate I that is better right divided by the interest rate I correct okay. now in this what are we given we have six percent compounded monthly so six percent compounded monthly so that the monthly loan of twelve hundred dollars can be withdrawn for one year so total monthly loan is how much so we write pmt is two hundred dollars right so that is the monthly loan and for one year so the duration is one year and in a year, since we are doing it monthly, we have to do 12 installments. So N is 12, correct. Interest is also monthly, 6% compounded monthly. So interest rate will be 6 over 100, that is percent, times 1 over 12, right? So that becomes your interest rate. So you could write interest rate as equal to 0 0.005. Now, 6 is half of 12, correct? Okay. So we get all your figures. Now, we just need to use calculator to find the answer. Correct? So let's substitute these values and get an idea. So, so we get 200, 1 minus, 1 plus, I is 0 0.005 to the power of minus 12, divided by 0 0.005 correct so that is how we should be calculating the present value so we have 200 one bracket one minus another bracket one plus point zero zero five bracket close power negative 12 we have to close the bracket divide by 0 0.005 answer so you get a value which is equals to 23 23.786 so i'll round it to 79 so that is the amount rounded to nearest cent which i need to deposit so our answer is that we need to deposit dollar 23 23.79 now so if you deposit now, then from this amount, every month, 200 can be withdrawn for a period of whole year, right? That is the whole uh, meaning of this. So I hope you understand what we're trying to do here. And also that the total money over a period of time will, should, will be much more since the interest rate has been accumulating on it, right? So I hope that helps. Feel free to write your comment, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for watching and all the best.